Up next, tune in for a glimpse of a signature event in the global business world. Now, we'll take you to GE's Lean Mindset Leadership Summit, happening today in New York City. So, better. so a good bit of reflection yes. over the course of that year, over the course of that season. Have you been able to shape the Bucks organization to think about success and failure, winning and losing in the same way, or is this really largely Giannis's view? Uh, no, I I think when we when I got with the Bucks, I was 18 years old. 18 years old. Uh, I was a skinny kid from Greece. Uh, did not know what the you know uh, the future had for me. Hmm. But I, I knew two things. I'm going to work hard. I'm going to lead by example. Uh, I'm going to under uh, promise and uh, over overachieve, over deliver. Mm -hmm. uh, every single day. I'm not the guy that loves to talk about things that um, I want to accomplish um, because I, I don't talk the game. I, I play the game. Uh, and the ten years going to my eleven years now with the Milwaukee Bucks organization, I'm. I'm definitely aware that I've, I'm able to help and shape the culture of uh, the Bucks organization with uh, people that they add to the team, uh, that they're, they're over themselves. Because like you, once you get to the NBA for a uh, lot of people that they're not aware, a lot of people, get, like I say, 10 to 15 percent of the NBA players really love basketball. Hmm. You know, which is, and it, it's, it's okay because sometimes in life, like, you do something that you don't really enjoy, but you do it because of the things that it provides for you. I understand, but like, um, I'll say that um, the moment that, you know, players get to the NBA, they kind of have the, the mindset, okay, I made it, they kind of relax. Mm. Or other players get to the NBA, you know, uh, you get that first big check, you know, and you take care of your family, you're happy about it, and uh, you want the next check. You get motivated by, by money. Um, for me, it's, it's totally different. I'm, I'm motivated by greatness. I'm motivated mm -hmm. by continuously Im improving. I, I'm, I'm totally, and this is a third uh, set of NBA players, that they, no matter how good they are, or how many years they've been in the league, they never get over themselves. It's all about <laughs> them. So I realized quick, quick, uh, as I was leading the, uh, my team, that I had to get over myself. It wasn't about me, it was about them. It's how can I get the best version of, of themselves. Early in my career. Stay tuned to hear more from Wolfgang Puck and David Gelb in the next hour.